Well, celebrating a major milestone calls for a little something extra in the gift giving department. That's why today we have our lifestyle blogger, Christina Deloma, here with some really great gift ideas. You are so creative, my dear. Thank you. Actually, these all came to me, so I'm just putting everyone else's ideas to good use. Wow, well, they know who they're giving their yeah. gifts to, the creative girl. <laughs> all right, so these really are priceless gifts when it comes to a milestone and something really personalized, aren't they? Yes. I mean, we think, okay, it's a big milestone, a 21 or a 30 or a 50th anniversary, and you should spend a little bit more money but you could also go and spend a little bit more time make it about that person get it engraved go the extra mile put in a picture in the frame already doing that type of thing makes it that extra little spark that it needs all right so nice let's talk about best friend gifts because they're so near and dear to our heart they are yeah my best friend and I went to different colleges so she got me this excellent item right here and high school I went by Tina I know I can't believe I'm saying that out loud <laughs> and she got us we went to different colleges different states decorated it my favorite color at the time which was purple and sequins, of course. And sequins, I mean, obviously. And inside are these little memories and antidotes of Aww. all fun memories that we've had together. So if ever I got homesick, and like this one says, how we will always be best, 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 best friends. So, Sweet. and I, I love this one in particular because I can add to it as time goes on and our friendship evolves. That's a really great idea. Yeah. All right, what about when you turn 21? That's such a big age. It really is. And this was an amazing gift I got from my roommate at the time. So this, we went out, obviously. Mm -hmm. And this is the wine bottle from that. And all around here are all pictures from the event that she modge paused onto the wine bottle. Oh, that's so this really is cool. this is a gift after the fact, but there's me going crazy. A lot of my people <laughs> having my first sip of alcohol, different people that were there. It's a really awesome, awesome gift. Did she do the glass as well? You no, know, the glass was actually hand drawn, and this was for my 30th, you know, keeping with the alcohol theme. And this was just a <laughs> party favor. Theme. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> this was a party favor where everyone got a personalized glass so it goes hand in hand oh my gosh all right what about the other milestones like maybe 30 yeah so 30 and this one actually goes for any big mother daughter gift so we print recipes we're on Pinterest all the time but where are the handwritten recipes I always want those in my grandmother's box maybe. exactly <laughs> so I got this for my mom to fill out because I tell her what I want Aww. and she actually went through here it's called my recipes book and if you go inside they're handwritten recipes from my mom some of them are blank so I can still add to it but stuff from the crock pot to our family desserts. That way, from now until eternity, she can always add to it, and I have handwritten recipes from my mom. Isn't it funny, because they say our handwriting is so important, and that's something that our kids will really look back on and cherish. I agree, and you know, she's of the age where everything was in cursive, and everything looks so beautiful and pretty, so I love, love, love this gift. Very nice. All right, what about taking these mementos and making them part of our home? Exactly. So we have these big celebrations that occur, and what do you do with all the paper? I love putting little tchotchkes in shadow boxes. Oh my gosh. So this is actually a shadow box from my 30th birthday party. I have a Woman of Power magazine that I had everyone signed, because Woman of Power, Go Girl Power. Yay. And then all the cards are actually in here too, so I can do this. And I did this also for when I went to Harry Potter World. I had oh. the memento, I had the big picture of me on a Quidditch stick. I mean, it's a really cool memory that I can have displayed out. Everything's all in one box, and it's just a great little piece of entertainment and memory token that I can have in my home. Right, something you can look at, but something you can also talk about with exactly. friends when they come over. Exactly. Exactly. Great ideas, Christina. Thank you so thank much. Thank you, Gina. All right, if you'd like to find out more about Christina, get other lifestyle tips and hacks, you can follow her on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Pinterest, and YouTube.